Most people hate rain, but when you're looking for the fun guy, ain't nothing better than a bit of rain. Oh. You got enough storage to hold a whole lot of mushrooms here. All right, cool. See, you've got some mushrooms right here. Fungus are a truly fascinating life form. Of course, you've got to be careful for lookalikes. There is literally a lookalike species of mushroom for virtually every variety. Um, and it can mean the difference between a, a meal that you can enjoy with your friends and family or a trip to the hospital, or a day off work, depending on the severity. All right. You know, being somebody that was super interested in pursuing a career in the performing arts, uh, I've, I've discovered a new way to, t to tell a story without anybody around. I mean, obviously, I I'm behaving pretty normal with, with you folk and company, but if I'm out here on my own, I might be having some strange conversation with a tree or a, a fern. Uh, the first time I, I picked any kind of mushrooms, I was probably about 13 or 14 years old. Um, but I don't think I, I had nearly the same relationship with it uh, then that I do now. Yeah, I mean, I've become a little bit of an odd job kind of guy. But uh, this is how I primarily pay my bills when the time is right. This being the right time. Booyah! There's one. I think that's it for here. It's probably about 20 bucks, but we haven't been out that long, you know? And based on the time of year, I mean, you can see we've got about a quarter, quarter of a bag. I mean, a good, a good day for me would be three of these. I'm pretty frugal, so 20 bucks goes a long way, but uh, yeah, I mean, that's a lot better than I would have I hoped. real visceral element of satisfaction that you get from from eating food that you picked, that you grew, that you found, uh, you know, so. My name's Caleb Reed, and I'm a mushroom picker. <laughs>